Hi, I'm Anya from Urbigo, and we are upgrading your apartment into your own smart vertical garden. But first, let me introduce you to Eva. Eva is a millennial. She's a young, busy working woman living in a crowded city center in a small apartment. Even though she's so busy, she tries to eat and live as healthy as possible. This is why Eva tried to grow her own plants. She tried with herbs, she tried with spices. But every plant Eva grew, Eva killed. So she became a serial plant killer. To help people like Eva and to boost urban green, we created Urbigo, indoor smart vertical garden. Urbigo is automated, which means that you don't have to worry anymore about watering or lightning. Vertical design saves your space while reconnecting you with nature, and our app allows you to control your plants and become a part of a bigger community. With rapid urbanization, there is a growing need for organic and locally produced food. Especially millennials want to know what are they eating and where their food comes from. And with help of IoT, we can transform almost any indoor space into a vertical garden. And here we found a market opportunity. Urbigo can be installed on your wall, so basically you just need a wall for this. Sensors that are integrated in our vertical panel track every plant that you grow, and what's best, we use smart soil pods with preceded plants that you order from us, making the process easy and clean for you. When you install Urbigo on your wall, you connect it with your phone using just Wi-Fi. This allows you to monitor your plants, to get notification whenever they need care, but also to connect with other users, share experience, and learn from each other. There is a special feature too called Virtual Climate Tree, which allows you to track your own climate impact. We, we plan to sell our product online using our website, so you can basically choose the design and the size of the vertical panel you want, but also the seeds of the plants that you want to grow. Of course, we have global competitors, but we are the only ones who combine, combine hardware, software, sustainable materials, and nature in one product. This led us to have more than 200 people applied from all over the world to test our prototype. And now we have 15 paying customers in Belgrade. Our goal is to have a scalable, de scalable design that will allow us to uh, have a maximum production with minimum cost of reinvestment. We, we are now testing Alpha prototype with 10 well-selected users, and we are actively searching for an investor, a better say partner, who will help us grow our business and starting from seed investment. We're a young team of scientists and engineers who think that all of you deserve at least a square of green in your apartment. So if you're an investor or you want to know more, please get back to us. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right on time. Perfect. And let's go over to the jury. I, I have a question right away. I mean, this looks from the pictures that you are growing herbs or something. Can you really do also like decent food like mice or wheat? Or, and, and what is the harvest you can get out of it? Uh, we actually show on the pictures our alpha prototype. So this is not our definite version. And for, for now, we have two starter packs, including herbs and spices. But we're definitely experimenting uh, further, further with uh, sm small wedges, let's say, like that, 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 that you can grow in your apartment. But it depends on the customer needs, of course. Hi. Very good presentation. It was really eloquent, and you were very clear. Um, I would have one question related to the cost of production, and then what is the price of your product, and what margin are you making? Because considering the production of your pieces, then the transport, logistics, what is at the end of it? It, it wasn't very clear in the presentation. Thank you very much for the question. First, I just want to say, say that we are a four-month-old startup. So for now, I can just say what will be the cost of the beta prototype. Uh, it will be 99 do uh, euros for our uh, customers, and uh, the production cost of a beta prototype is 35 euros. So this is not something that will be sustainable in the long run. This is not a price that will be defined for a, a final product, but for beta, we thought when we gathered the feedback from the customers who wanted to pay, uh, we confirmed on this price, so 99 euros in Serbia. First of all, thank you so much, and I really like the positive and the good energy, so compliments on that. 
you were saying that you were looking for partners in the room, right? So what kind of partners are you looking for for the next phase of your growth? Actually, we want, uh, I mean, we want, we are look, act actively looking for somebody who could help us scale and grow our, our business globally. Uh, we are currently located in Serbia, but unfortunately, Serbia is not our target market. We want to grow in the markets where we have the biggest competitors, like North America and North Europe. So we are actually looking for investors who want to invest in uh, our region, but who are actually willing to show us how to expand on these markets. Great, thank, thank you. you. Uh, re related to that, I was uh, wondering, how do you plan to uh, go to market and get traction with this, and, and what kind of customers do you see as uh, the potential customers to start adopting it? Well, we are still, we are still working on customer development. Uh, we actually wanted to show you our, for now, the customer segment that we have. This, th those are millennial, female, let's say females, more females than males busy working women who don't have enough time, space, nor knowledge to grow their own plants, and who, are, who were looking for the similar solution on the market, but were not satisfied with it. Um, when it comes to traction and ex exit to the market, we're, we're, we plan to sell our products online. So basically, when you go to our website, you can order everything from the vertical panel to seats. And um, we have some traction for now, but those are not sales, sales traction. It's more of the subscriptions and the beta testers and people who are willing to pay. But not still like sales directions. Okay. <laughs> Are you working full time on your uh, business? Yeah, uh, actually, my business idea was born in Helsinki during my studies, and a uh, few months ago, I mean, before uh, four months ago, I have started to work full time since I'm a CEO. And uh, I think that you have to put yourself in this story if you want to succeed. There is no other way. Okay. All right. <laughs> That's a great end. Thank you so much, Anya. Urbigo.